summer means mosquito season. This year, the insects may be more than just a nuisance. In some American vacation hotspots, they may be carrying malaria. It's a concern because malaria is a life-threatening disease. It's not often seen in the United States, and we haven't seen it domestically acquired in over 20 years. In Florida and Texas, a small number of locally transmitted cases have now been reported. The only thing they have in common is that they are not linked to travel. It is a little alarming to have a disease that we've eliminated from the United States and then have these few local cases, um, but they are a few cases. Malaria is a parasite carried by certain mosquitoes. It's most common in Africa, South America and Southeast Asia. Globally, it's responsible for about 600,000 deaths per year, though symptoms are most often mild. It feels like a really bad flu. However, some people go on to develop complications. Florida's Terracia Island lies near where some of the cases were detected. It's where residents are now taking extra precautions. I've had to be more careful using mosquito repellent, which I never used to do. Researchers warn malaria's spread may be part of a new normal as climate change takes hold. Even small changes in temperature, rainfall, humidity can lead to these diseases being transmitted in new altitudes and new latitudes. All of the patients infected in the U.S. have been treated and are said to be improving. The Centers for Disease Control is urging doctors to treat future cases as a medical emergency in a season full of outdoor gatherings and favorable conditions for mosquitoes. Jackson Prosco, Global News, Washington.